I don't really want to do player room. Player summons, though. Oh, right, it was him casting that. Oh, that makes sense. Hello, Miss Dragon, I know you're going to try and... Huh. They're not trying to attack me now? They're not trying to attack me now. Like the Drake Keeper still appears, but I uh, <laughs> pretty much expected that. You don't want to attack me. Oh, this has made my life a million times easier. So every time we lose to the Ancient Dragon, we just gotta warp away and warp back, and then they're like, oh yeah, you're chill. Because I can deal with that. Because I am A okay with that happening. Even if these dragons up on the staircase are still pissed off as I'm... I'm still happy. And happy is not usually a word you use to describe a Dark Souls player. But I'm happy. At least the blood stains on here anymore. <laughs> oh god, I'm gonna die. The, the bowing, the bowing. They're bowing, or and you're not going to attack me. No, that one's still hostile, but I pretty much st expected that. These w oh, these ones are still hostile. It was too easy, wasn't it? Too easy. Something had to go wrong. Something had to go wrong. <laughs> I fucking hate this game. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. Everything about this shitty fucking... I should have expected it, if I'm honest. Of course, the ones next to the door would be pissed. I was about to try and kill the fucking leader. Right, so uh, these lot don't stay pissed off. However, their leader at the top does. And then the three of them get really pissed off as well. So I don't know how I'm going to get past that. Someone tells us the dragon people aren't going to be like, Oh yeah, wow, an alluring skull. Never mind, they're pissed off again. Okay, boys, I know where I'm going. It's, n it's away from the dragon shrine. Or at least going to try and beat some dragon ass. I don't know. Maybe if I beat enough dragon ass, they'll be like, whoa, this guy, this guy's pretty good. And then they'll just stop. But that's not gonna happen. Well, at least these guys up here are on annoyed, right? So only some of them are grow, that's interesting. What time is it? Yeah, it might have to be Ancient Dragon then over with tonight. Just because my head's pounding, the game's pissing us off. I'm just really not in the mood for it.
Can I lure you guys out here? Whatever, jumping attack's good. No, I'm gonna have to fight all of them. I'm going to have to fight every single motherfucker on the way at the shrine. Oh, this is gonna be above my peer grade. Oh well. I'm gonna warp the dragon shrine, I'm gonna fucking walk back up here and I'm gonna hope not everyone in their mother is aggroed. Cause if they are, I'm telling you right now, the ancient dragon. You know what, actually? I'm gonna say fuck you, ancient dragon. I'm gonna showcase some shit about you. So you remember when we fought the Duke's Dear Freya? That... We found the body of an ancient dragon. Just hanging from the ceiling. And you're both thinking, well how's that? The co is there two ancient dragons? No. That dragon that we're trying to fight, but we're not going to fight, because fuck that, I'm not sitting here all night. Maybe I'll do that later on. But that dragon is a fake. It's a fraud. It's not the real ancient dragon. Because the real ancient dragon is dead. I don't make the best life choices, do I? Oh, maybe I do. I don't, I don't fucking know. Right, so when we fought the Duke's Dear Freya, we found the Ancient Dragon. And now that we have the Ashen Mist Hall, we're gonna pay him a visit. Because when you kill the Ancient Dragon, you get like something and the sword. Ooh, you get the Ashen Mist Hall if you attack him before you speak to him. Which would be a very stupid idea, for the love of God, just please talk to him. Don't make the game that much more difficult on yourself. Yeah, you'll notice that giant fuck off rock that wasn't there before. Let's go talk to the rock. Oh, did skip that cutscene because fucking I've had enough of that cutscene. And here we are, the dragon memories. Even here, messenger head. Gorgeous view. Poor soul visions of lightning. Or <laughs> even here, the dragon is dead. The ancient dragon soul. Rest in peace, ancient dragon. And with that, we can now go on to the thing I was going to do, because like I say, it's my playthrough. And if I don't want to fight that fucking ancient dragon because of his fucking entourage of people, I'm not going to. And the silver giant he drops would only make the next thing slightly, slightly easier. So next on our agenda... It's the return to, well, we're going to see the king. That's right, we're returning to see Vendrick in the Undead Crypt. You might be wondering what the Giant Souls are for. Well, if you remember the description of the Giant Souls, Will the giant's re resentment for the king be pacified in death or only emboldened? Meaning that the king has super duper high defense and is basically impossible to kill unless you have 
the impossible to kill unless you have the giant souls. So that well, that's what we've done. We've got the I didn't. Son of a bitch. Now that we have the giant souls, we can actually we stand a chance against Vendrick. I was tempted to put bonfire aesthetic, the um, the black gulch, but no, that would just be cheap. So, if I'm not going to get it at least sort of legit through the ancient dragon, then I don't want to do it at all. It's not even necessary either. You can do it with four, no less than four though. Five is like the. If you make, want to make sure you really kill him, you'd get five, but four is still perfectly fine. I'm gonna open the fucking bridge, because I can tell you right now, despite doing Dart Lurker in two attempts, War Vendrick, he's not gonna be such a pushover. And all right, the dragon rider stays dead. That's interesting. And after we've done this, we can. There's a couple of things we can do, and then we'll be returning to the things for Twix to hand in our smooth and silky stones. Next session, we start off by getting the DLC keys, and we begin the first DLC, the Crown of the Sunken King. However, in the meantime. I'm going to have to edit all these videos because I've got a massive, massive backlog of content now that I haven't figured. So anyways, get Fendrick's attention. Doesn't seem to be paying any. How rude of him. Get buff up. And we're going to start beating these legs. Quite a tall man, Fendrick. Got to see. You see we're doing damage, but we're not doing massive damage. With any less, we'd be doing even less. But, to be honest, we're only doing this much because I've got a fucking break book on. And, I'm using pine resin. I'm not sure if he's weak to lightning or not, so I don't know if the lightning's having much of an effect on it. But if he hits you, he hits very hard. However, I'm not sure his moveset changes at all beyond like the couple of things that we can see him doing. Just sword swipes. He he doesn't have like a grab attack or anything. Yeah, that, like I say, it does quite a bit of damage. I'm trying to remember who discovered the giant thing, because I remember everyone was like, Whoa, Vendrick's so difficult! But then like, someone's like, Haha, I have the solution, you need giant sword. Then one's like, what the fuck? Like, it does say in his description, like the giant sword description. I don't know if they changed it since like the first release of the game. I don't know. I wish this was more like more much more epic fight, like we're fucking killing the king of Drang Lake. But nope, we're just hacking at a fucking really tall hollow's legs. At least the music's pretty cool. And our bright bug has run out, so we're only doing like 154 damage. I also didn't know point out when it first happened that the um the Pine Resin was only doing like an extra 30 damage from the looks of it. So it wasn't too essential. <sighs> he 
You know when I said we won't be doing Vendrick first time? I was like, yeah, maybe we will. Until I just got greedy and stopped paying attention with fucking attack. So we're going to have to sit through that all again. <laughs> Aren't you happy? Because I know I'm... It's ecstatic. I also didn't read the ancient giant soul, so we may as well do that now. This powerful being stands and waits for whoever may visit him. Oh. Thanks for that really in-depth lore from soft B team, you fucking dickheads. I don't know, he's a hollow, so maybe fire? Don't have time for you, Mr. Skeleton. You're scary and you're spooky. You're spooky and you are scary. Two things I do not need in my life. Try jumping in short hiding, please. What? Oh! That's cool! Can't believe I fell for that. I saw the chain, I'm like, oh, maybe that's like a... Maybe that's a secret area. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Oh, but I think on that note, I'm going to end that here. So, I'd like to thank everybody for watching. Next session, Vendrick dead. The, the key's obtained, and we'll be doing at least one of the DLCs. But I don't know when my next session is, because I really need to catch up on it. So, that being said, I've been Crow Rot, this has been Dark Souls 2, and we are not fighting the Ancient Dragon, so fuck you guys. <laughs> and I'll see you all later. Bye.